Riley from Osceola Middle School. Uh, I found the Roller Coasters 101 pamphlet very informative. We looked over the articles and we coded it for what we thought was important, what we learned, and what we didn't know. When we came here to Bush Gardens, we figured that we would understand that roller coasters go fast and they make us dizzy, but we didn't understand that there was so much physics behind it. What are some of the physics properties that you learned, like some of the rules of physics? We learned that there's three basic laws written by Sir Isaac Newton. These laws state that, uh, the first law states that objects in motion stay in motion, like the roller coasters. When they stop, they just want to stay stopping there until you push it. And the second law, things can collide and they net force. Third law, for every action there's an equal and opposite reaction. The coaster going, you're moving. Um, there, we also learned that there's energies, like kinetic, potential, mechanic, electrical. All these things make up roller coasters. Kinetics like the energy of movement. Potential is non-moving, but we have potential all around us. Gravitational potentials keep, keep us to the ground. So this is great. You, it sounds like you learned a lot of information about roller coasters before you even came here. What, what sort of opened up your eyes from actually being on a roller coaster? When you read something, you don't quite take it in as well as you actually experience it. You know, like, oh, you get dizzy, you get kind of like, it's the gravity, like, yeah, we just experience it every day, but when you actually get on the roller coaster and you experience the momentum, the speed, the energy, then you realize that it's a lot different from reading, just reading it. Okay, so here's the big question. While you're on these roller coasters at Bush Gardens, were you thinking about science? Yes and no. When you when you get on the roller coaster, you're like, oh, I'm so excited. And then when you actually get down to thinking it, like before the first drop, you get you start to wonder, hmm, I wonder what's making this move. I wonder what's making it go. And then the science class helped us realize, wow, this is all potential energy, momentum. So you know you're not going to fall out. Yes, we are definitely not going to fall out. <laughs> Hello, my name is Brandon from Osceola Middle School, and I saw a... Uh, Coaster, Roller Coasters 101, and what I learned from that about riding roller coasters today was about force and speed and acceleration and how it lets the coasters go fast and how gravity is needed and Newton's first, second, and third law and how it helps the roller coasters go and work and stuff. So do you think it was important for you to come to Bush Gardens to, to actually reinforce that science lesson? Yeah, definitely, because I was able to experience all of the Newton and gravity and all the laws and everything here today. So were you thinking about science when you got on those roller coasters? Yes, definitely. Tell me what you were thinking about science, scientifically, as you were on the roller coasters. How fast it would go. and all of the gravity needed to do all the spins and stuff on the Montu and Chikra and all that fun stuff. 